welcome back if you're a returning subscriber, you are the best. And welcome if you are new, hello, hi, I'm Katie. And welcome to With Love Katie YouTube channel where I share all things fashion, um, positivity, vlogs, all that good stuff. Um, so today I'm bringing you a date night outfits video which is highly requested over on my Instagram so if you're not following me on there it's at with love Katie and two underscores and I'm very excited to bring this one to you because I am sh I've shopped somewhere that I don't usually shop and I just wanted to do something a bit different so I've actually shopped in Miss Selfridge which isn't somewhere I have shopped since I was young. So I'm actually really excited to see what the pieces are going to be like, share them with you, give you my honest feedback as always. I am quite honest on here, but you know, that's what you guys need. And also for reference, I am a UK size 12 and I'm five foot nine because you always seem to want to know. Also, I'm a shoe size seven, but I have wide feet. So I'll be honest about the shoe size fitting for those wide fit girls because I know it's a pain in the butt to get ones to fit. So without further ado, let's get into today's video. There is a piece in here today that is a little on the um, obscure side not really my style if you have been on my channel before you will know this is really not me but i kind of like feel like maybe you could rock it if you were in bali and you were a bit having like hippie vibes but we'll just see how we get on with that one let me know your feedback when we get to it what made me laugh was from my last Zara video, you guys loved the yellow dress that I thought looked like Big Bird, which absolutely cracked me up. You guys were literally loving it. So if you've not seen that haul yet as well, make sure you head, um, I'll leave it up here so you can watch it. I'll leave, also leave it down below in the description box. I don't know where that came from. I don't know where that came from. But if, if you are new to my channel, please hit that subscribe for some good vibes and let's just get into it before I go Scottish again. As always, everything will be down below in the description box. If you can't find anything, give me a shout and I will send you the link personally. There's a few bits I've added in, like shoes, bags, maybe from elsewhere. So I'll try and leave all that link down below. If I cannot, just ask, like I said. And come over, just come over and say hey on Instagram, you know. Help a girl get to 10k. Love you forever. <laughs> Let's go. I'm gonna start with this sexy little number. Oh my god, I literally love it. I love this. I saw this on one of my favourite Instagram babes, one of my little friends over there. Um, and how cute is this? It's a little dream in a dress. It's quite short, but I mean, date night, you can pull off, get them legs up, girl. Oh, honestly, they. this is a little babe. This was £35, so I think that's kind of reasonable for a dress. It is thin and only single lines, and it has like a bit of an odd material, I'm not gonna lie, but the style of this dress is what I absolutely love about it the most. I just think it's so cute and girly, and obviously the color is super feminine, and then, yeah, it's still a bit of sexy. So if you are new here, I like a bit of cute and sexy all in one. Cute at the front, sexy at the back. Oh yeah, cute at the front, sexy at the back. Actually, this top's kind of like sexy or both. Didn't really realize that, but there we are. Um, that is what I like. So cute, sexy, girly, feminine vibes, just like us, classic vibes as well. Things that are just gonna stay in your wardrobe forever and you're just not gonna have to get rid of them. That is my favorite kind of style. Um, so yeah, this is just that to a T. You guys will know if you're not new here. I love puppy sleeves. I love anything slightly off the shoulder. Like, just I just think it's really elegant. Getting the collarbones out, very girly and chic. And I just think this is really pretty. Um, the fit was great. I wasn't sure what the sizing was going to be like. I was worried it was going to be a little bit snug, but it actually wasn't. And yeah, I think. Apart from it being a little on the short side, so if you are tall, it's bad that I mind. But yeah, I really like the ruche bit at the bust, and I just, I'm in love with the sleeves, and it's just really just a cute little dress. You could wear this with anything you've probably got at home, some nude heels, a little nude bag, and you've got a whole outfit in one. If you've got a blazer, chuck it on the top, that would look really nice too. Also, you could wear it a bit more summery, wear some nice sandals, some nice flip-flops with it, or even some wedges. I, in my last video, I think it was my H&M haul, um, which again, I'll leave them linked down below because that's all you guys faves. Um, I said I wasn't a wedge kind of girl, so I wanted to try another pair just to make sure. 
and I'm not a wedge kind of girl, but these are a great wedge height. If I had to wear a wedge, I would definitely go for a smaller wedge like this. I think it makes it a little bit more classy and a little bit less 90s. Um, obviously these are actually really in right now, but it's just not my cup of tea. I love the neutral colour on these. I love the fact it's got ribbons to tie up the, around the ankle. I think that's an absolute dream come true. I love the heel. I love the material. I love the colour. I like this that goes around the back. The only thing that I don't like is this like faux snakeskin print on the shoe. That for me is just a little bit chat. It's just not my thing. They're only £25, which is an absolute steal, I have to say, for shoes that look like this. Um, so that is a bargain. I got these in this UK 8 because it didn't do wide fit and the fit was lovely. That's my kind of little trick as well. That if you don't, if they don't have wide fit, if you've got upper size, I don't know what, it just gives you a little bit more space within the shoe and it seems to work. So, unless I've just gotten to a size 8 and I didn't realise. But I don't think my feet are still growing when I'm 29, surely. Anyway. Um, yeah, so I like them, but I am not a wedge kind of gal. If you are, these are really cute and just like perfect for perfect for summer. Next, we have a little shorts and blazer combo. So I'm a little bit obsessed with shorts blazer combos. I think they're even a little bit nicer than than like trouser and blazer combos. I just think shorts. I think I because I have long legs. I quite like having my legs out. You know, we, I've got cellulite on them, we all do. 90% of women have cellulite, it's not obscure, it doesn't need to be changed, your body's not broken, it does not need to be fixed, okay? But, get the legs out, wear the shorts. Honestly, you're not gonna be on your left bed when you're 90 and be like, oh, I'm so glad I didn't wear that outfit that I really loved, because I was so conscious of my cellulite, that 90% of women have. Anyway, back to the clothes, but my point is made. This is an absolute dream. This is £39, I just thought it would be a little bit more. Um, it's really, really nice. It almost looks like a linen style material, but it's like, it's double lined. It's really classy. The fit was lush on this. Absolutely just dreamy. It's like really nice and it's fitted but loose cash, so it doesn't make it feel too smart because I, like I said, I love blazer combos, but I always feel a little bit too smart in a blazer. Whereas I feel like this is like the perfect amount of like smart cash that you could wear it with all different outfits. You wouldn't have to just wear it with shorts. Um, I really like the sleeves that are just, they're already turned up as well, which I think gives that more casual, obviously, look. Um, and they are cropped, which I think is really nice. It doesn't have a button, which I think would have been a nice little thing, but you could always tack a little something on there, keep it together. Um, yeah, so I'm really, really impressed with this. Um, and this is probably one of my favorite blazers I've ever talked about on this channel because it is so wearable. And for someone who doesn't want to feel overdressed or feel uncomfortable, um, this will be just ideal. And I'll show you the shorts now that go with it. So the shorts are really cutchy and cozy and just chill vibes. Again, they're like this comfy linen style material. They've got a tie around the waist. They're called paper bag shorts. They are 29 pounds of it. I think it's quite affordable for a set. And I think if you sign up to their email list, you get something like 15 or 20% off. So it's definitely worth doing. Um, or stealing someone's, you know, email that you haven't signed up before if you've shopped on there before. Um, but yeah, I think these are really cute. The fit again was really nice. They got really comfy little pockets. Um, they're just super chill. They do need a little bit of an iron. My mother will probably be going, why is she not ironed that? I sell. <laughs> yes, they're not ironed. But, you know. I've got time for that. I really like those. And then I paired it in the cutaway with um, just a Zara body which I guess you guys probably have a body of some sort or a lace bralette you could wear. Something you just already have. So you don't have to go and buy a whole new outfit for date night, whether it's meeting someone new or just with your partner that you've got now. I always think it's nice like dress up and make effort. So yeah, and you've got to keep the spark alive. Cause baby, you're a firework. I'm not gonna carry on. I, you'd think I, you'd think I'd had like all the coffees under the sun. I've literally had two coffees all day. That's it. I don't know what's going on. I would say I'm happy it's Friday, but I mean I work for myself, so I work every day. It doesn't make any difference that it's Friday and I'm filming this. You guys watch it on Sunday. Happy Sunday. Hope you had a nice weekend. Okay, so this is a list. I actually thought this was a play suit, but it's not. It's a little dress, but it looks like a play suit. I love this. Normally I'm not someone who goes for like this much colour or even things with black in. I'm normally more of like a whitey kind of gown, more neutrally tones, but this I actually really love. I think 
the only thing I think it would have been a little bit nicer is these had like gone in up, up the sleeves, but that's being fussy. £35, it fit really nice. It was actually quite comfy, like there was a little bit of room in it, and you know, if you're gonna go for a meal and sit down, you wanna have a bit of room. Let the belly expand. <laughs> Um, yeah, I really actually love the colours in this. It's got a nice low um, neckline and then it's got the really cute frill detail. I always like it when the frill goes sort of like into a, an opposite V, like an upside down V. I always think that's really flattering on the legs. Always makes that like them look a little bit longer, a little bit more, you know, get a little bit of leg out, girl. But then you've got your arms covered, so you're going like sexy and sophisticated, cute as well with the ditzy print and the frills. So it's just like best of both. And then I paired that with a little pair of Zara shoes and a little pre-mark handbag. Again, super simple. You guys have probably got a little pair of black heels or you can wear black sandals if you didn't want to wear heels. And then just a little black bag. And that bag I think was like eight pounds. So just really, really easy outfit to wear. Okay, so I've got another little cohort now actually. I love this, I love it. And on, I felt like, Sexy Spanish senorita and I needed to go dancing. I felt like the Spanish dancer emoji. The flamenco, flamenco, flamingo. I don't know, you know what I mean. Um, so it's a really cute little top and then a ruffle midi skirt. So it's a little crop. Um, the only thing I don't like on this is the buttons. They actually, they actually are nice buttons. But I just kind of wish it didn't have them. I don't see the point of buttons. Um, I love the way it ties at the back. It's really, really cute. I love the adjustable strap. As you guys know, I'm all about practicality. Oh, I'm so boring. But I actually am because it really irritates me when like, things are falling down or you can't adjust them because we're all different in lengths and heights and things. So that always makes it very good. Um, this is just £16. So really, really affordable and super cute. And you could definitely wear this. Like, look what I'm wearing now. Literally a pair of white mom jeans. You could wear it with normal mom jeans, you could wear it with little cute white shorts, little cute white summer skirt, midi skirt. This is gonna be quite versatile for just the top, but then also obviously you can wear it as a pair. Really lovely with this skirt. And I, when I put it out of the bag, I really wasn't sure, so I was like, well, it's a bit bright, but I actually really love it. Like I'm so surprised how much I love it. It's just kind of like my colors, my, my style. I don't normally wear this much colour, but I feel like I now do because I love this. I think it's gorgeous. The skirt was £29, and like I said, everything was in size 12, and everything has fit great. The skirt was a little bit loose, like there was a bit of room in it, but like I said, if you're going to be sat down or something, it's going to be comfy, and we're all about the practical life. I love the ruffles on it. I actually, like close up, I'm not really a fuss, fuss on the print, but um, I'll show you it. I don't know, I don't. I do and I don't like the print, but I like the effect when you like look at it as an outfit as a whole. So again, you could wear this like not this top, but like any like little white top. You could wear this with any bodies you've got. Um, nude body, pink body, red body, green. It's kind of endless. So yeah, really, really easy to wear. And again, you could wear it like some sandals or some heels, dressing it up or down. On the term of sandals, I have these to share with you. They're 18 pound. They are cute. Um, they've got like snake skinny, gold and white um, vibes. I do like them. The only thing, because you know I'm practical, I found was I don't like things that tie, you've got to tie them up. It's a bit of a faff, isn't it? Like I'm quite low maintenance for someone who, who has a fashion channel. <laughs> I'm actually really low maintenance. Like I don't really like things that you, like, you have to make a big deal out of. I just wanna like chuck a pair of shoes on and get out the house. I'd be taking five, 10 minutes to put these on. So if you are much more high maintenance and you can deal with that, then they are a really cute pair of sandals um, and gonna be super versatile. You can wear them like for evening, with evening dresses or you can wear them really casual to the beach. So, you know, they're gonna be a versatile pair of sandals and I just think it's good to have a little white pair of sandals um, because they just go with everything. Okay, so I'm also gonna talk to you about this little top that I've got on now. This is, um, just I think nice for like a little, just a little classic piece. Again, it's never gonna go out of style. It's a super neutral color, which means you can wear it with all different sorts of things. You could definitely wear it with black, white. Literally the list is probably endless. You can wear it with jeans, anything. Like it's just super versatile. I like the thick strap. It makes you feel nice and supported. I haven't got a bra on with this, as you guys probably know. I don't like to wear a bra. I came back from Bali last year and I was just like, bras, goodbye. It's been a good relationship, but we're over. 
this is the breakup message. I will never see you again. <laughs> and honestly, it's been like that ever since. I think the only time I've ever worn a bra since then is like if something was a bit see-through. Um, occasionally I'll wear like, like those stretchy material things. But that's it. I don't do like wiring and all the pain and all the marks that they used to leave. I'm not about that life. So anyway, um, yeah, I do feel less than support in this. You can tie the back up to your own taste. £29, which I actually think is a little bit more than I would expect to pay for a top like this. It is nice quality. It is a nice material. And it does feel like more of an evening piece. You could definitely wear it like chill to the beach with shorts and things. So you could get the wear of it and make it more versatile like that. But... There we are, that's that. Okay, next, I haven't even actually put these on properly because I'm not a huge fan of them. I just think they're a bit boring, but they're a nice classic shoe if you don't have one. Also, the heel height is way too high for me. I would not wear this heel height out, but I'm not everyone, so I'm still gonna share them with you guys. These are 35 pound. They are like a really pretty classic pair of shoes. They're just, for me, it's just a bit boring. Like there's, there's not really much about them. Like a muted, um pink blush color um they're wide fit though which is great i just feel like wide fit shoes though are just so boring which is why i always try and squeeze my poor little feet into normal fit shoes because they do so much more range retailers if you ever watch this please make a bigger market of wide fit shoes don't make them so boring okay thanks um yeah but like i said they're just they're just that's what they are. I'm not really going to talk to you guys about them too much. They are pretty. They're just basic. Um, and then they've got a little gold buckle on there. Apologies for my messy nails. If you saw. Also, if you haven't seen my nail tutorial, I have a giveaway where you can win your whole own set of gel nails. Um, so like with the UV lamp, with everything, so you can do it at home, which is just nice at the minute, I guess, if you're not really comfortable going out and about or if things are you know, closing again because who knows what's going on. Um, I'll leave that down below. And it's just basically a really easy, quick nail tutorial. It tells you how to do it. And then obviously it tells you how to win the prize as well. Um, yeah, so make sure you do go over there and watch that after. I'll leave it down below too. And then this is the thing I was a bit like not sure of. So if I was in Bali, I would totally wear this. I wouldn't do anything I'd wear them together. It's just too much pattern going on. We'll talk about the trousers first. So. I just feel like they're a bit pyjama vibes as well. Like it, I love the pattern. I love the colour. I think it's re it really is gorgeous. And then it's just got like, they're quite just like loose fitted, wide fit leg with this cute little pattern and um, bit inserted at the bottom. These are 28 pounds, which I feel like they're like quite a lot for what they are. I think like you get these in pre for like eight pound. Um, the back is stretchy. I, like I said, I like the colour and I like the print. I'm just, I just feel like they're giving me pyjama vibes. Like, what do they give you? Um, I think you could probably wear them with like a nice little white crop. That would look quite cute, a little pair of white flip-flops. But I don't think I would wear these two together as a combo. Um, and then this is the top. So this top is 28 as well. I think this is pricey for like what it is. I feel like this is the reason I stopped shopping in Miss Selfridge because it is a bit pricey for what it is. But actually, I've, having, I've been done for days all. <laughs> Having done today's haul, I um, I do actually really like the brand again, and I do think I will be shopping them more because I'm really impressed with all of the other pieces. This is the only piece, and like I said, I am very honest, but I just think you've got to be like, what's the point of me coming on here saying, yeah, guys, this is lurched if you actually don't like something because I don't want you guys to buy shit. So yeah, basically, this is the top. Um, it's got a tie bit at the top of the back which I do think is cute and it is a really cute style and again this would look kind of cute look with these white mom jeans with some white shorts actually as two separates I don't mind them but together I felt like they looked like PJs and um, the bust area just got this cute little I don't really know what to call this cute little bit again and then it's got just like again sweet um sweet sweet little sleeves exactly at the bottom of the trousers and then it ties at the front and you can undo it obviously and tie it as loose or tight as you want um so yeah that is that is that like that's definitely not a date night outfit that was just a little piece that i wanted to buy to see what it was like um because it looked really nice online if i can find the picture i'll pop it here but 
yeah that is today's haul i hope you guys enjoyed hope you guys enjoyed today's date night inspo and if you are gonna have a little date with your loved ones enjoy and thank you so much for watching today's video if you are new here please remember to hit that subscribe for all the good vibes join our good vibe tribe make sure you head and watch any of those videos that are listed during here oh, stay on my channel because you know you've got to keep the good vibes up like i said thank you all for being here enjoy the rest of your sunday evenings or whenever you're watching this video and i'll see you in the next one upload videos monday wednesday and sunday so thank you and i'll see you soon